Hi and welcome back to another video of Medic Notes. This video is on why descent abnormalities in JVP waveforms. I will cover on the two main abnormalities, which are absent and prominent Y descent. Prominent Y descent is also known as the Friedrich sign. First for absent Y descent. The Y descent represents the drop in right atrial pressure that occurs when the tricuspid valve opens and blood flows into the right ventricle during diastole. This is a picture showing absent Y descent in cardiac tamponade. Picture A and B shows the femoral, right atrial, and pericardial pressure before and after pericardiocentesis in a patient with cardiac tamponade. Note that before pericardiocentesis, there is an X descent but no Y descent. Post pericardiocentesis, there is an increase in femoral artery pressure and a decrease in right atrial pressure, and the Y descent is now visible. Absent Y descent is most commonly associated with cardiac tamponade. Sometimes it can be caused by tricuspid stenosis as well. For its mechanism, any pathology that may limit or prevent ventricular filling in diastole will cause an absent Y descent. In cardiac tamponade, pressure from pericardial fluid surrounding the heart leads to a higher left ventricular diastolic pressure, which impedes filling of the ventricle during diastole, and thus blunts the Y descent. Rarely in tricuspid stenosis, the filling of the right ventricle is impaired by the stenotic tricuspid valve. Therefore, right atrial pressure remains higher than normal, and an impaired pressure descent occurs. Next we look at prominent Y descent, the Friedrich sign. This is a faster and more prominent descent of the JVP during diastole, coinciding with the drop in right atrial pressure that occurs after opening of the tricuspid valve. Prominent Y descent is seen on physical examination as an abrupt collapse of the neck veins during diastole. This picture shows a prominent Y descent in constrictive pericarditis. Note the elevation in pressure and prominent Y descent corresponding to rapid early diastolic right atrial emptying. Prominent Y descent is commonly caused by contrictive pericarditis. Other less common causes are right ventricular infarction, atrial septal defect, and atrial fibrillation. For its mechanism, in constrictive pericarditis, early diastolic filling is not inhibited, but filling becomes impaired in the last two-thirds of diastole when the expanding ventricle hits the rigid pericardium. Once this occurs, the pressure rises again to a higher than normal level. The Y descent appears accentuated as it descends from a higher than normal right atrial pressure. For its sign value, a prominent Y descent has been found to occur in about one-third of patients with constrictive pericarditis, and two-thirds of patients with right ventricular infarction, although studies are limited and it is often difficult to see in a clinical setting. Presence of the Y descent is valuable when interpreting waveforms on cardiac catheterization to diagnose constrictive pericarditis. The presence of a rapid Y descent excludes the diagnosis of pericardial tamponade. That's all for this video. Thank you.